Our family is Turkish. We didn't really have much money growing up. My dad kind of sacrificed his life to bring us here to the United States. He had kids here and want them to, you know, live the American dream. So he kind of wanted us to pick money-making careers such as a doctor or a lawyer. He introduced gaming and technology to us. Definitely did backfire on him because all we did was we took that and we ran with it. First video game I can remember playing on the PC would be Return to Castle Wolfenstein. We had our own clan actually. We were called the Peas. I was frozen peas, my brother was sour peas, and then his friend was sweet peas. As I started playing games like Half-Life and Counter-Strike, he really started watching me play then. Tariq was like a shadow. He wanted to hang out with his older brother a lot. I would just stand there for hours. I don't even have a chair. Maybe like get a glimpse of his headphones and like hear what they're saying. He's like four years old, five years old, and he shouldn't really be watching me blow up people's brains on a TV screen. He would tell people he wanted to become a professional video gamer. My dad would chime in and say, you need some real aspirations. But little Tarek, that's what he wanted to do. He had that vision that we didn't see. He was really believing in something. My first pro team was a group of friends that I knew, and they decided, hey, let's give Tarek a shot. Hayes and Cutler were on that original Mouse Pass team, and they're still playing with me today on CLG. Hayes, he would chill like in our mumble together and played other games with us, and same with Tarek. I had only known them from playing online for about five years before I finally met them. First time we actually met in person was really something I'll always remember. Well, I'll slightly remember, I was pretty drunk. <laughs> We're just kicking it like we usually do on Mumble. It's just now I'm putting a face to the voice. On weekends, I try to get out of the house. Playing CS all the time is stressful. You just get off your computer, go to the beach, something, anything. The gaming was big issue here, really big issue. His father broke his computer so many times. Dad took his desktop and slammed it onto the floor. It just broke into pieces. I just get home, my computer's just not there. Like, how does that happen? This isn't a joke. I'm in a league, I got tournaments to play. He had some money, he put some parts back together, and boom, Tarek's back on the computer playing video games again. Tarek is Turkish-American, so since we live in America, I also teach them my culture. We have a Turkish community here in Brooklyn. It keeps us connected with our roots, and I'm grateful for that. I feel like if we didn't have this community, then it would sort of be isolated. He's always talked about how he's like Turkish, but you know, you kind of really realize it when we were at the major in Columbus. My family coming to the major was amazing. It was just unbelievable. The electricity of the stadium, the fans. It was an amazing moment for me. I remember like asking my mom to bring something for me, anything that represented my nationality. I gave Tarek a scarf. I was expecting a flag, so it was more like I was walking out with a scarf like this. It was different, but I think it was cool still and it showed what I was going for. Everyone saw it and all the cameras caught it. I want the scene in Turkey to get bigger. I've been talking to like the Turkish team, Space Soldiers, and that's like the best Turkish team out there. I'm doing my best to like help get them exposure. There's a lot of land centers in Turkey and there's always like packed with people because no one has like good enough computers or internet and you gotta go to the land center to play compared to here in the States where everyone has sick PCs and sick internet. Tarek's like one of the best big brother I've ever seen. The way he treats his family in general gives you a whole different respect for him outside of gaming. He loves his sister and his sister loves him so much. She's really his number one fan. This one's me and that's my brother. I wrote like a little message over here. Hi Tarek, Abi. That's how you say like older brother. I miss you very much. I hope that you have a great trip. I hope that you can also win all of your tournaments. And don't forget to buy me a gift. My sister is amazing, I love her a lot. Sometimes I feel bad for her because I can't spend as much time with her as I want to, but I try to come back home as much as possible. She's like really popular on my stream actually. She has her own Twitch emote, it's called Tarek's Sister. 
and it's just like this cute little face of her like smiling. The best thing I think about his stream was where he's like eating cereal. He looks up, headshots four people, still eats the cereal. No Shirt TV originally started when I was playing in this room, actually. It was just super hot in my room and I couldn't take it. I was raging and I was just sweating everywhere and I was like, screw this, I'm taking off my shirt. It just became like a norm on my stream, sorta. And then I was like, hey, why don't I just make it my brand? Raging is not a part of my gameplay, but it's hard to not rage. You feel like you should have killed them, the server didn't register, whatever it might be. It's just like, F everything now. What do you think about his language? The what? Cursing, cursing. Oh. He curses a lot. He curses a lot? I didn't know it was a lot sometimes. Really? Tarek stopped cursing then. <laughs> now that Tarek's able to make a career out of this, my dad watches all of his games and he's all about it because there is money in Counter-Strike. That's unfortunate, that's the reason. If I was happy and I wasn't making money, I don't think it would be the same. But that's life, you know, you gotta make a living, you gotta make a career. Tarek will never give up. He's never gonna stop. That's the attitude that he has. He just has that drive. He's gonna keep pushing forward and make it to the top.